how to get the unshakable confidence unshakable confidence self confidence self esteem what the confidence is confidence of doing confidence of not doing what we say see when we say confidence who you are what you are if i am an engineer and if somebody ask me about the something which is not in my knowledge which i have not studied suppose some chartered accountant asks me something and i am engineering student or i am engineering studied i have not gone through all the balance sheets trading accounts then what i will say i don't have the confidence to tell him or tell her if i am having knowledge of something then only i will have to go for the confidence if i don't have the knowledge of something what the confidence stands for the main problem is that we are always thinking somewhere if we are losing something we are losing that there is a short of confidence lack of confidence for example if i have to go for some exam i have not studied i have not studied that much which was required i was just enjoying in the my last days before the exam i was studying in a year throughout the year but in the final last days i was not studying now in the exam what will you say when you go for the exam sitting in the examination hall what will you say i don't have the confidence you have not studied so your confidence definitely will be lose and if you have studied you have studied enough then you should relax fully sit in the exam because confidence is when you put your best efforts to the subject whatever it there let it be your education let it be your office work let it be your personal any work if you have not put your hard work if you have not put your best efforts to any of the subject you don't say that i don't have the confidence confidence always comes when you give your best efforts to any of the subject if you are not giving your efforts you will say i don't have the confidence are definitely you should not have the confidence you are not worked with the full efforts the main is your efforts for anything if your efforts are the best with what is coming in front of you you will never lose your confidence because you are never putting your best efforts to the whatever subject you have in front of you let it be business let it be any office job let it be your studies let it be even relations so you always feel somewhere guilty in you because of not putting your best efforts so important is that let me tell you that you should put your best efforts to the subject whatever is there 
फॉर एग्जाम्पल इफ आई एम गोइंग फॉर सम एग्जाम से बैंक ऑफिसर और आई एम गोइंग फॉर सम एग्जाम से आई एस और एनी क्लरिकल एग्जाम आई एम गिव एग्जाम्पल आई हैव टू गिव माई बेस्ट आई हैव टू गिव माई बेस्ट वट इज द बेस्ट Suppose if I am, I have filled up, I have filled up the form for IAS. Then I should know there are ten lakh people if applying for this eight hundred post. So how much hard efforts I have to put for this? If there are, suppose I am appearing for some clerical post, forms around five thousand. and jobs around 3000 example i am getting never there so how much effort you have to put ias if you are going 800 out of 10 lakh so see the work and 5000 application and 3000 post so it means if you are studying for one hour there You need ten hours study here. Likewise, if any business you are going for any work, put your best efforts. If you have put your best effort because you are human being, in twenty-four hours you need sleep for six to eight hours. For other activities, your food or any your daily routines. Give more two to three hours, so twelve hours is gone. Twelve hours is the maximum outcome you can give from this your physical body. If you go for the some top most exam or top most your business where you say struggle, I am struggling hard. Give your best. That is the last twelve hours. Even in spirituality, we say that you should not work for more than eight hours. Eight hours for your work, eight hours for your sleep, eight hours for the one who had made you up in the morning. Good morning, you said, because of the one. What you have worked for eight hours, the one he was inside, your body was working. So eight hours for the one. who actually is the main in you eight hours for the god for true karma eight hours for the world materialistic that rajo karma maya karma eight hours for the night sleep what we say tamas sleep because in sleep what you are doing nothing but if at all you want to break the rule of this putting your best efforts over experts it is 12 hours your brain is also having the capacity your body also need revival of your cells so this is the equation now the important is your best efforts if you are given the best efforts for anything you never take yourself as failure even the result come failure because in ias is not that that time more brilliant were sitting there are many people who attempted two time before yet they have come to the third time again many reservations are there you have seen many reservations are there ex service man scst other class backward class so where you stand in general category if you are coming to the 40% percent, wait me 320 seats are there 5 500 you will not get so you have to keep in mind that if you have put the best efforts forget i am pass pass but i done the best next time again i'll try if i want to continue if i have the time if no time age bar something gone not the problem we have heard fortune awaits another fortune Tomorrow you may become some way a businessman. 
somewhere you may come banister you see then they are hiring in the company all businessmen those who retired from the even is post on the big chairs there but they are not officers you see many of your big richest people are not having any qualifications of that higher stage but still they are hiring the all qualified people in the world why you want to die for that that why i am not clearing your fortune maybe that you become the big businessman same in the business you have to put your best if not got what could what can you do so confidence what i want to say to you is connected with your best efforts if you put your best efforts confidence will never go down and in that you should also know the theory of your being as i said you earlier too you have to understand the destiny luck what is that you are recycling of birth and death cycle many time before you had come many time before you will come if you don't understand this your i who you are from where you come who is sustaining you who had created you so after death the result will come at the time of death result will come where will go the next after this body so all these knowledge is of your being which is connecting with the spirituality life you are your being the conscious the soul inside so once you understand the theory of your destiny putting the best efforts you will never lose your confidence when you say i am losing the confidence it means when i not prepared he was just at the last somewhere working before he had not prepared so no confidence in the business not put his best efforts depending on others only not observing so all that wherever you are not putting your best efforts makes you are confident down and once you put your best efforts the confidence will never go off it will always be apprised and parallelly if you understand the life means your theory of being why you are born why all these things are happening with you what the life after death then automatically everything will be cleared your everything is pre scripted scripted that can only be changed with your journey towards the creator the god can be bartered your destiny can be bartered so once you understand all these things the spirituality as well as doing the best karma best efforts from your body to whatever you are doing wherever you are you will never lose your confidence and you will remain happy all the time all the time if you fail also failure is a big success for those who put their best efforts failure is having more experience than a successful person remember it because if you put your best efforts and you fail you are more than a successful person successful person remember it once he gets something he stop himself going further failure always keep on trying 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 so he is more brilliant provided he puts the best efforts to whatever subject he had so the main is putting the best efforts and secondly is knowing about your being destiny then you will see all the time you will be happy doing everything with full confidence and that the result will be here in this lifetime from birth to death you will be blissful and after the death departing from this body you will be back to your home the god home and that will make the success of your life you will neither feel inferior or superior nor you will lose confidence anywhere 
So whatever comes in front of you, do the best. That's why spiritual master always says, be in present, be in present, not here thinking for other things. Wherever you are, put your best efforts. Wherever you are in study, put your best efforts. You are in business, put your best efforts. Wherever you are. And then result, forget. Whatever the result may be. For you, it is past because I put best efforts. So this is what I have said to you. Furthermore, to get more confident, more stronger, you have to continue with the spiritual lectures. That will make your inside confidence to the more strong mode. Because where you understand the whole concept of your being, the confidence will never get down. Even sometimes you could not put your best efforts because of some reasons. You will not weep. Sometimes you see somebody put best efforts, but at the exam he got fever. He got fever. He got corona. As you see, corona. Any, any disease. He could not go. She could not go. Not appeared. Then the theory of destiny will come and the one will get relaxed. That's why I say to you. So I hope you would have understood. And if not, continue because in a small lectures will not make everything. As I said you earlier too in my lectures, spirituality is a big subject. If you understand, in the minutes you can understand. If not understood, may take months and years together to know about. The important is you should be blissful in relaxed state all the time. Okay.